So let's go back to the Sonny Carson thing. So this was, what was it like? I mean, what was that vibe like? And, and, and is that, you said that's what led you to Blackwatch, right? Yeah, no doubt. My 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 uncle, um, brother Thomas Washington, he, he put me on to Sonny Carson because he always stayed, you know, close to like the Amsterdam news and, you know, you know, all kind of different things that was happening in the city just on a grown man's tip. So when I met Professor X, son of Sonny Carson, um, I told my pops and then he asked my uncle about him. He said, yeah, Sonny Carson was a stand up brother. So um, it took me a while to earn to meet him because, you know, the elders didn't believe in hip hop. You know, he didn't believe in rap. You know, you know, we don't want to even, you know, try to fake like they was like, yeah, you know, come on, rap for me. It wasn't about that. They just weren't aware of it being used as a tool for freedom of speech, you know, because everybody was basically goofy at that time. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of goofy rap out. So, you know, there was there was there was no clan, you know, and, and P.E. was, you know, evolving into what they are now. You know what I'm saying? So if you wasn't close to the air of the street, you know, you never heard any God bodies really busting or anything like that. So the elders would have no clue. So I was basically that first window for them to say, you know, you know, we can get 4,000 people in front of the square. You know, we can go to another town and link with our comrades and get, you know, a house full of soldiers instead of, you know, goofy flat tops and, 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 and foolishness. I don't, I don't diss hip hop, my Lord. I'm part of it. But, you know, it's a time and place for everything. We, at one time, we focused more on the fashion of it than, than the building of it. You know what I'm saying? You know, I don't, you know, it's evolved to what it is now, even more goofier than ever. But, you know, I'm sure people that are grown now look back and wish to put a little bit more fire to the pen, you know, so their music can be used in, in a timeless manner. You know, when all the revolution started, I was honored to hear FTP and, you know, Grand Verb and Funk and Lesson. People who had, you know, were taking apart pieces of our albums and playing it while they were, you know, planning what they were going to do next, right. you know.